Hello people, it's this Wagon Sheeple, August 2nd. I don't know if you can see this. There's a big old hawk that just landed right here on the light pole. And it's got other birds diving and bugging on him. <laughs> Anyways, I've been sitting here praying this morning for answers to the things that I ponder and pray about. And the Lord is purely amazing. Yesterday I was praying about marriage. And uh, after a couple of three hours of working through my own anger issues and asking for truth and what the Lord wants what I can say you know I'm in the middle of praying and I look down and there's a dove standing in the entrance of the garage and I knew that that was an answer to my prayer that the way I feel about marriage being very holy is the truth that the Lord takes it so very seriously And that the way men have changed the meaning of marriage, basically. It's a marriage of convenience these days. It's not a marriage of holiness, not walking with the Lord or talking with the Lord. It's something completely different. Here, let me see if I can change this a little bit. Oh, I think we're fully zoomed in, but a big old hawk sitting right there at the top of this light pole. It's not usual. It doesn't normally sit here. I come out here every morning when I get up, pray, and I talk to the Lord. But back to marriage, if you're considering it, you're not going to find true marriage in a courthouse. Sticking some hunk of metal on your finger doesn't mean you're married. Signing your name to some piece of paper doesn't mean you're married. But only that which is done in the sight of the Lord is truth. So if you're going to do a marriage... Do it in the sight of the Lord with all your heart, mind, soul, body, and spirit. And all of those that are around you need to be walking in the same path. Well, God bless each and every single one of you. Have a wonderful day. I got sprinklers to go work on. Something new for me is young man that usually does all this stuff is in captivity so taking over his duties trying to make sure that this household continues even though he's absent strange thing is is I've started having dreams of him like being him well there he goes he's got something in his foot a little mouse or something that cute little dog <laughs> have a wonderful day in prayer people because prayer is the key to the Lord's heart you need to know the answer to something he can grant it you just have to be open and receptive to the answer and truth when he delivers it God bless you guys